Guys, gals, ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to the channel. My name's Look at Hot Shot. I hope everyone's doing okay today. We're here. EU4, Auto Blob, Vibing, Stuff and Things. Yes. Uh, episode, I think this is four. Uh, but yeah, this whole series is going to be live recorded over on twitch.tv forward slash liquid hotshot YT. There's a link in the description if you want to go check it out and help a brother out. But yeah, if you go on to enjoy the video, drop a like and subscribe. But with all that being said, let's let's get in it. So, in the last episode, we slapped up Dulcadia because they slapped up AQ. Uh, <clears throat> and basically what we're going to do is we got Hiss and Kaffir here as a, a cheeky little vassal. I reckon... What we're going to do is we're going to feed Hiss and Kaffir, uh, the rest of Dulcadia, this province and this province, that's 15 dev, and then feed them um, this bit of Kurdistan here um, as well, and then integrate them. And But for the time being, it'll be a nice little buffer zone between myself and QQ, who are obviously allies. But yeah, no, uh, that, that, that's the thing. Uh, you march to Constantinople, please. You are... Getting men back. Need I need four thousand men, and we get four hundred every month. Okay. Uh, let's not lose the prestige. I'm happy losing a bit of dip power. That's that's cool. And we also did have a coalition form between Kanda, AQ, Caraman, and Mams, but because we're allied with QQ and Tunis, it's kind of negated that. <clears throat> so that's a thing. And, you know, we have a, a quite a strong army. Like, I mean, on a normal day, we'd have 45,000 men. But on a not-so-normal day, we have 38,000 men. So, you know what I'm saying? It is what it is. <laughs> Something sounds wrong with feeding Kurdistan to the Ottomans. <laughs> Sick man strong. Yes. Sukabliet or something. I don't know. Okay, so Tunis came out of that fine. I assume that's just because it was trying to protect Gran Granada. But yeah, we'll get a royal marriage with them. That's cool. We could also start moving... Well, no, because if I declare on Kandar, well, the coalition will fire... And I don't want to fight the coalition, if I'm being honest. I'd, ra I'd, ra I'd rather not. So I guess we're going to take some time. Uh, maybe dev up the country, build some buildings. You know, infrastructure. <clears throat> you keep seeing that boat and thinking it's Poland. Yeah, you play too much hoy. Yeah. Wow, plus 43 ducats a month. Yes, please. Um... It's cheaper in Thrace. Are you in Thrace? No, you're not. Okay, so it ends there. So we'll do that because it's cheaper to build it there. Conquer Austria as a FU to European borders. Uh, QQ is requesting that you come to aid in the QQ conquest of... Kikiti against Georgia. They start... It's an offensive war. And they're allied with Karaman. Sure. Might be able to actually jump in then. <clears throat> Let's go then, Karaman. You think you've got what it takes? Can you, can you bring it to the limit? Can you take it to the limit, homie? Oh. Oh, he's done him. You've been absolutely done, you mug. Why is Portugal... A Portugal really marching. Oh, my God. They're marching all the way around because they can't get mill access to Granada. You have that. Just... Oh. <laughs> they legit went constant. Yeah. I just stack wipe the Caravan army, please. Let me do it. Thank you. I didn't stack wipe it. I'll stack wipe it there, though. There we go. Nailed it. Uh, let's jump. For the time being, we'll just put half of you guys there. 
whilst we sweep up the rest of the country. So this is a, this is I was about I was about to ping, dude. I played so much Hoi Four, I was about to press Control and Alt and then <laughs> and then click because it pings in Hoi. I was about like let's take yeah this and this and right okay, solid. Do that. Get the final core. Dude, dude, bad habits die hard. Well, I mean, it's not a bad habit. Like, pinging, it, it helps you guys see exactly what I'm looking at, right? So, if you, you know, if you're unsure sort of vibe, but... Oh, we got a... Oh, no, we got a diplomatic insult from Venice. Oh, no! National tax. Adopt the provincial government system. Dude, we're making nine ducats a month and my army's reinforcing. I'm pretty sure I'm okay. How how insulting? How dare they? Um They don't even have a general. You guys move here. And then you can group up. There you go. Hiss and Kaffir, do you have any troops, homie? No, but they're giving me 0.13 ducats a month. How convenient. You should kill them. Don't take no shit from nobody. Yeah, I would do that. But, you know, uh, currently, just trying, to, just trying to get my army back into full shape, man. Like, I mean, I'm fighting this war because I'm a nice neighbor. You know what I mean? Me and QQ get on like, like two peas in a pod or something. Navy weak. Yeah, my Navy is weak. You're not wrong. But the, pro the problem I've got is I can't build many. <laughs> mush. Uprising in mush. How dare you? I guess I'll have to put it down. Oh no, wait, 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 wait. Oh no, it's in Kurdistan. Oh, Turkish people putting down Kurdistan revolts. Oh no, I'm gonna get banned. Oh no. <laughs> yeah, up until you get to the other side of the ocean, you realize, oh shit, the world isn't flat. Something's wrong, I can feel it. I can't jump off these seeds yet, but I'll have you, him turn around. Oh, I had an ally come in and help me. Who? Oh, yeah, it's just it's just QQ. Hello, QQ. Can I get it on 35? Gosh damn it, you game. Gah. <laughs> I'm so frustrated. I am up, I've had it up to here. Up to here, I tell you. I should form Yugo 500 years early. Imagine. That would be absolute scenes for Tito. Way Nice one. Alright, go and help him. Oh, no. We don't really need it, but... Okay, so Caraman's done for. I'm just... I can't separate peace because apparently I'm a junior partner. I didn't take over the war because... Reasons. Yeah, okay. Cursed. Yeah, you go... You go in 14600... 1460 would be very cursed. Honestly, bro. Oh, they gave me two provinces. Thank you. See ya. Thank you for the 100 biddies, man. Appreciate it, dude. I'll uh, drop some drop some liquid hypes in the chat. Apo apologies recording and people over on YouTube, but you know, this man deserves some liquid hypes. If... Come on. Here we go. There we go. There we go. How convenient. Right, are we good? We, 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 we're grand. But yeah, no, thank thank you, Sierra. I appreciate you dropping the 100 biddies, man. 
so what we got we got two provinces from that war very nice um a wise man would say how convenient and i think i did say that but yeah i think at, right now we do just need to um kind of chill um recover recover men because one of our fourteen thousand stacks is literal dog water it's trash headset you know what i'm saying ottomans aren't real ottomans can't hear you eu4 yeah exactly e -e exactly dude i will i will hurt anything all right and let's put you just in his and kafir dude honestly can invest in that but no i want miltech 5 now Okay, so how goes the coring? Which one is it? It's here. Yep, so we're coring these two provinces. Should be making more money now. Bit badge noise. <laughs> noise. Uh, I. Local unrest. For 10 years minus tax yeah that's fine i don't expect i'm gonna be at war for the next 10 years mom looks are having an issue but they still have more men than me so uh i honestly i can't get it to work bro it's so annoying it just literally won't work for some godforsaken reason Recruitment time minus 30%. Well, hello there. Hello, skills. Hello. How are you doing? How are you doing? Hello. Would you like to sit? Try a different bot. I don't think I will. Honestly. You found, you found a tinfoil ball, aren't you? Come on then. Hello. Hello. Yes, hello. You just punched my mic. Pricey is missing out. Would you like to sit on my arm? Yes, hello. There you go. <laughs> this is premium Twitch and YouTube content, honestly. There you go. Yes, be best cat toy ever. A ball of tinfoil. Hello. Hello. So yeah, no, he's doing okay. Uh, he is obviously. He how old his skills now? He's seven. He's getting on a bit. So he lays around, and doesn't do much all day. But then, then he'll go outside, run about for a bit, get tired, come back in. So. But he is exceptionally fit for his age, even though he sleeps all the time. So, yeah. Hello. So, skills. <coughs> yeah. Spends hundreds of pounds on cat toys and beds, etc. Cats, boxes and balls of tinfoil. That is literally him. Literally, my mum's my desk chair was in here. And there was a box, right? We had to fill it because we know what skills is like. And we had to literally fill it so he didn't want to jump in. But he'll literally sit in boxes for fun. Like he's like, oh, this is this is this is the best thing ever. Because he's like surrounded by walls. So he's gone off to go sit on my window, so I guess we can continue. That's like the little interlude for, for today's YouTube episode and a bit of the stream as well. Where is Philber? F, F I L, I. Here. Yeah. What fifty percent chance? How about I give them one hundred percent chance of losing? How about that one, Chief? Have you thought about that one? Oh my gosh! Oh no! Oh no! Your troops are dead! Oh no! Such a shame! Oh no! Anyway. Q 
QQ beat Georgia. And look at QQ, man. Look at him. Look at is is there a, is there another is there another player in here? Is there another player in here? Because look, he's going ham. QQ's had a great start. QQ does look beefy, and that's a lot of damage. It is. It is a lot of damage, honestly. You come in. Oh, there's a big fat fuck off now. Yeah, even Timmy isn't even that beefy. Look. Timmy's weak as fuck. Who's back, though? He's, uh... Yeah, he's, uh, pretty big. <laughs> That's a thing. That's definitely a thing. Okay, so... I need 10,000 men. Oh, I'd love it if I could drill. I mentioned this in the first episode. I don't have any of the DLCs. So... I can't drill and then slack a recruiting stamina so I can get free manpower. Uh, let's get free prestige. So yeah, it's a thing. I've just got to kind of uh, sit around for a bit. Like, I know I could consolidate, but I'd rather not. Uzbek strong in Siberia. Yeah, exactly. Who, who the hell is clapping Poland? Is it Denmark? It is. The Vikings are back, ladies and gentlemen. Ooh. Right, we've got Diplotech 5. About to take Miltech 5, so that's why I'm not grabbing offensive. But yeah, I love it when we get minus 20% core creation. That'd be lovely. Can Hiss and Kaffir even recruit men? Like, hello? Probably not. I mean... They pay 15% of their income, which is 0.13. They probably can't even <clears throat> afford a thousand men. They're like a little count in Crusader Kings, dude. They're, they're, they're... You're nothing! Absolutely nothing! You're worthless! Alright. Sitting 500 ducats. Sitting kind of vibe, honestly. Um, honestly, let's just build more mosques. Build three at uh, point thirteen. Okay, so everyone's leaving the coalition as we get Miltech five as well. <clears throat> Uh, mill, it's here. Great, we'll grab Azab infantry. See you later, skills. Yep, he just comes in, says hi, and uh, fucks off, basically. Okay, so I know Kandar's not going to be much of a threat. I've probably still got a truce with you. Yes, I don't have a truce with Kandar, right? No. So... How about we uh, we fight Kandar? Take Kandar out of the equation. Because then I believe that's... Yeah, that's an entry port. So, um... Better trade money, right? Yeah, he loves to say it. Love to say it. <laughs> uh, okay, so we have permaclaims on you. Uh, no one will join me, but that's fine. Uh, what we will do, though, is move you there. See if we can clap them straight away. Fate of the Crimea incarnate. So we can get a subjugation CB on Crimea. So we'd have to fight them to make them my bitch. Or we just say, nah, I'm not really interested. Which I'm not really interested in at the moment. I mean, if I have to have fight in the Crimean region at some point, I'll fight in the Crimean region, but... Not right now. I'm not bothered. Because, obviously, we're still... We still need, like, 4,000 men to go into this army, and then I'll feel safer. Right, okay. Take Sinop. Game is paused. Um, we should be able to clap him. What am, what am I? Russia? Yeah, dude. 
Do you not remember the Crimean War? <laughs> yeah, like I'm, I'm saying that as if you was there. Yeah, you know, you, you know, <laughs> weren't you around in the 1860s, bro? <laughs> Oh, was it 1880s? I think it was 1880s because it was like France. France got involved because they wanted to show that their army was still decent after getting clapped by Prussia. I, I was actually, I, I actually remember because I was there. <laughs> 1852. Oh, don't you dare. Who the f do you think you are, bitch? Why? 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 You're so mean, Mamluks. You're going in there and literally cooking me. Sorry, you've probably got dementia at this point in your life if you were around then. They're literally cooking me. If they take any provinces, they're cooking me. Like, it's as simple as that. Because then I have to fight Mamluks before I want to fight Mamluks. That makes sense. Oh no, you're disloyal. Oh no. Wah. Wah. <laughs> it was close though. <laughs> Memory ain't what it used to be. <laughs> uh, where's my... Seems as though we haven't made any progress. Let me grab my C's general. 1850's done a real number on you. I'm not surprised, bro. Oh wait, three siege pip. Let's go, baby. Thank you for the ghost host. I appreciate it, man. I know you can't hear me. But yeah, I appreciate it, buddy. Uh, let's uh, lose Diplo. We've gone up. But yeah, no, uh, that's going to have to be it for today's episode, guys. If you did enjoy, then please do drop a like down below. Subscribe if you are new and watch all the way to the end. And uh, yeah, thanks for helping out the algorithm. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Wow. Oh, I pressed the wrong button. See you in the next one.